The open letter from the group calling themselves Gymnasts for Change has 500 signatures. A lot of these uh, signatures have come with stories of abuse. One catalyst for the letter was the arrest of a 33-year-old male gymnastics instructor in Lethbridge charged with the sexual assault of a seven-year-old girl. How many more seven-year-old children need to be abused before we realize that we need to do something immediately? We have been calling since March for an independent investigation into the toxic culture of Gymnastics Canada, and we have been ignored. That independent third party is supposed to be the Office of the Commissioner of Sports Integrity. That's a new federal agency created to take on complaints from athletes who have concerns about their sports federation's ability to investigate themselves. But until sports federations register with this new commissioner, that commissioner has no authority to investigate the very complaints the gymnasts are making. And that's why Ottawa suspended the $3 million in federal funding Gymnastics Canada receives every year to compel it to register so that the commissioner has the authority to investigate. And I just think we need to start diffusing the power at the top, you know, with these organizations, again, that have sort of been doing all of this without any oversight. Yes, we're demanding that they sign on to the Organization for Integrity in Sports uh, as a condition to flow funding. But they shouldn't be worried about satisfying the government. They should be worried about satisfying parents across the country, that they're keeping their kids safe. Even still, some worry the new Sport Integrity Commissioner is still too close to the national sports federations. I don't trust it um, because it's not completely independent. When looking at abuse, it needs to be completely independent and completely removed uh, from sport organizations. And even so, more may be required. I think ultimately I do think there needs to be a body that is created by athletes for athletes that start to you know navigate this system with our best interest in mind. As for Gymnastics Canada it said in a statement it is working quote tirelessly to complete its agreement with the Sports Integrity Commissioner. David Aiken, Global News, Ottawa.